so today I'm going to be using a Klai wig that they sent over to me. This is the 150% density 24 inch straight wig with bangs. It's a 13 by 4 lace front. Um, I loved this hair. It came with, like I said, the bangs and it came with clips on the insides um, for, you know, your security. Um, this wig was extremely easy to put on, extremely easy to wear. All I did, you guys, um, was straighten the hair. Um, I didn't bleach the knots because to be 100% truthful, using a wig like this, you do not see the lace. So this is a perfect on-the-go wig. Um, I would recommend um, bleaching the knots if you did decide to like pull the hair up like the little sum up sum down look or whatever but to be honest you don't have to bleach these knots you just have to cut your lace and glue this on um, this hair was so soft I honestly straightened it because I just love my hair pin pin straight but this hair came pretty straight and silky this is the perfect on the go throw it out the box throw it on your head type of wig like it's genuinely seriously I just straightened it like I said and I did end up trimming the bangs a little bit because they were a little long for my face but if you have the other type of problem where they were too short you can always pull your wig up a little bit more and so this is just a fun easy wig I think for the the beginner or the the advanced wig wearer i think this is just a very very beautiful wig all right y'all so i have straightened it it's so pretty i barely had to really straighten it like it came so straight and silky i just added my heat protectant and I just got it even more like flawless you know so for this wig I am not going to glue it down like with my ghost bonds glue I'm going to use my got to be gel because this wig just feels so secure and it has the adjustable straps in the back to where I think it will be tight enough that I don't have to worry about any security or anything like that so I'm just gonna go ahead and actually use the gel opposed to the glue I'm so excited about this I think after I wear it today I'm going to um, dye this jet jet black I really love jet jet black hair on me and I think this in jet oh my god this in jet black um, will be really really cute so that's what I'm gonna do so for now I'm gonna lay this down and I'm gonna do my hair so y'all know the routine with how I do my hair under these wigs um, I'm just gonna braid my hair um, yeah I'm just gonna braid it in about six braids maybe less because my hair is pretty um, I have a lot of oil in my hair right now to where my hair is pretty flat already if that makes sense um, it's just really oily so it's not gonna be hard to um, to um, to um, it's not gonna be hard to get my hair flat today oh I'm gonna start my first braid here This is like such an easy hairstyle, I swear, because it's already like, for one, I'm not too, too worried about the lace. Like, I didn't, um, like I said earlier, I didn't bleach my knots because it's just not going to show. You know what I mean? That's just being really real. It's not going to show. Um... When I take it off today, I might decide to wear it with my hair like some up, some down, or might decide to throw the hair up somehow to where the lace will matter. 
but as of today and how I want to wear it, I don't have anything to be worried about. Okay, so right here I have finished off my braid and I'm just using some bobby pins to go ahead and secure this braid and make my hair flat. I'm just going to use it on like this one side of my head. If y'all have seen my videos before, you know this is what I do. This is what works best for me. I have sewn my hair down before when I wear my wigs for long periodically times. <laughs> but I know I'm not going to wear this that long so bobby pins will do. Next, I was just measuring the wig on my head now that my hair was flat. Just trying to see if there was any um, tightening I needed to do with the little things in the back. Oh my god, I cannot think of the word right now. Oh my god, what's the name of them? Um, the little clip things back there. I just was trying to make sure that I was good, okay, and that this wig was not going to be flying off. Alright, and so <laughs> I seen that I needed to tighten it a little bit, so I did. Alrighty, so next I just grabbed my got to be gel in the black tube just a little bit. Oh my god, I was so into that movie I was watching. Turn around! <laughs> Anyways, I just grabbed that and I just added it to my edges where I know I was going to be laying my lace at, dried it a little bit, added the lace on top, dried it a little bit again. You guys know the deal. Y'all know how this goes. <laughs>
All right, you guys, this is the final look. I really, really love how this came out. Some people might not like it. I love it. I love to switch up my hair, as you guys know. I can be one person one day and then a whole new bitch the next because of wigs. So I love it. Um, I love bangs on me. This hair was so. I barely. Y'all seen I barely did anything to the hair because it was already like. Perfect. All I did was straighten it and I trimmed the um, bangs just a little bit as you guys seen. Um, but yeah, so I love, 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 love this wig. It's Atea approved. Um, all the information will be linked below on where you can purchase this wig. Be sure to follow Clyde. Be sure to give this video a thumbs up and go ahead and like and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already thank you guys so much for tuning in and i'll see you next time